Syed Sadi Abdul Rahman, was sentenced to seven years jail and two strokes of the cane, and fined RM 10 million 2.9 million Singapore dollars on Thursday, after he was found guilty on all charges of abetting in criminal breach of trust. Misappropriation of Funds and Money Laundering Following the sentencing, the 30-year-old resigned as president of his own party, the Malaysian United Democratic Alliance Muda, but remains as an MP while appealing his case. Syed Sadiq has vowed to clear his name. Here are six things to know about the poster boy for the voice of the young generation in Malaysia, whose name has managed to be on everyone's lips from generations X, Y to Z, 1. Youngest minister in Malaysia's political history. At age 23, Syed Sadiq was made the youth chief of Part 1 Pribumi Bursatu Malaysia when Tan Mohata Mohammed formed the party in 2016. In 2018, Syed Sadiq was sworn in as the 18th Youth and Sports Minister under the then Pakatan Harapan government, headed by Dr. Mohata. The appointment made him the youngest cabinet member in Malaysia at age 25. An MP for Mua, Johor, since 2018, he founded the youth-based party Mude in 2020. 2. Cat Lover Syed Sadiq became the first candidate in his party to declare his assets amounting to about RM2. 81 million is at September 30, 2022, including the value of his two pet cats. His two cats were gifts from his brother and a friend in 2018. Pseudo-celebrities in their own right, Meow Meow and Toby, even have their own Instagram account at Yangbabulo, with over 12. 000 followers. A recent addition was made to his feline family, Wolfie, after the death of Toby in early 2023. 3. Champion Debater Do not be fooled by Syed Sadiq's boyish charm. As his oratorical skills packed a punch whenever he was debating in Malaysia's parliament. Although he has never scored an A for English while in school, he went on to win the title of Asia's best speaker in the Asian British Parliamentary Debating Championship. Not once or twice, but three times, in three consecutive years, from 2012. 4. Turned down Oxford. As a law graduate of the International Islamic University Malaysia, Syed Sadiq turned down two full scholarships in 2017 and 2018 to study at his dream university, Oxford. The main reason cited was he had to uphold his responsibilities as an elected MP to his constituents and country. In 2021, he took part in a postgraduate senior fellowship program at the Lee Kuan Yew School of Public Policy after accepting a scholarship from the National University of Singapore. Describing the six-week experience as priceless, he said, I've learned things I wouldn't have elsewhere. 5. Star Appeal on Social Media As a young politician, Syed Sadiq is not encumbered by limitations experienced by politicians of yesteryears by leveraging on social media. As one of the most followed politicians in Malaysia, he has almost 2 million followers on Instagram and 1.2 million followers on TikTok. His every move and opinion is being watched and tracked. Besides gracing covers of magazines, the latest being Prestige Malaysia, whose cover story is ironically titled The Future is Bright with Abe Lim and Syed Sadiq, his love life has also been a constant source of scrutiny for one of the most eligible bachelors in Malaysia. But he also had a taste of the dark side of social media when in 2016, some netizens criticised him for being a khaki clubbing avid clubber and posted a picture of him at a disco. Then in 2018, Malaysians were outraged by a photo posted on social media showing him shirtless in a bathtub undergoing cold water therapy. 6. Falling out with his mentor In July 2023, Syed Sadiq criticised Dr. Mohata, 98, 
who say that promoting Malaysia as a multiracial country is against the federal constitution. The dicey issue of race politics in Malaysia managed to drive a wedge between the mentor and mentee. Once a revered figure in his life, Syed Sadiq has since distanced himself from the political bulwark.